Meghan Markle and her soon-to-be-born child are a reward to Prince Harry for addressing the impact of Princess Diana's death on his mental health, psychotherapist Brian E. Gordon claimed. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are expecting their first child in the spring after nearly one year since their wedding in May 2018. Ms. Gordon suggested seeking psychological help following the death of Princess Diana has helped Prince Harry achieve his happy ending with Meghan. In 2017, the royal candidly revealed to the mental health advocate his struggle to cope with the death of Princess Diana in an episode of her podcast, Mad World. Speaking to Lorraine, Ms. Gordon said, he is a great advertisement for what happens if you face your mental health if you face your problems actually only good things happen. If you face the bad things that have happened during your life, good things come from it. And if you ignore it, the opposite happens. The fact he got help and dealt with those issues and now he is married with his first child on the way. So adorable. I saw them recently and genuinely, lovely, happy first flushes of love. Prince Harry admitted he began to go to therapy to address the repressed emotions about Princess Diana's passing at the urging of his brother Prince William, and the rest of the royal family. Ms. Gordon said she felt amazed by the normality Prince Harry and Meghan Markle had shown during her meetings with the couple. She continued, he is a normal person despite the trappings, and the title and all of that. He is, and I say this genuinely, the most normal person. If I had gone through what he had gone through, I would be crazier than I am now. It really amazes me how down to earth and grounded they are and how passionate they are about stuff that affects all of us. Speaking about a recent lunch date with the Duchess of Sussex, she added, She's lush? She's lush but it would have been like going out with you. We ate monkfish, she fed me some of hers. We swapped through, we talked about yoga. Again. She's really lovely and normal and down to earth. During the podcast, Prince Harry admitted Princess Diana dying when he was young had had a quite serious effect on both his personal and public life. He said, I can safely say that losing my mom at the age of 12 and therefore shutting down all of my emotions for the last 20 years has had a quite serious effect on not only my personal life but also my work as well. And it was only three years ago, funny enough from the support around, and my brother and other people saying you really need to deal with this. It's not normal to think that nothing has affected you. Royal experts have suggested Meghan Markle and Prince Harry will honor his mother's memory with their approach to parenting when their first child is born in 2019. ABC royal contributor Imogen Lloyd Webber said, Meghan and Harry want to be really hands-on parents. I think Harry and Meghan are clearly thinking how can we give this child a life where it doesn't automatically have its life mapped out for it? Columnist Roy Nikha said, Harry has spoken very much about how he appreciates his mother Diana's trying to give him a normal a life as possible. He wants to do the same for his child and Meghan's.